kind of grew up with dairy and about 10 years ago, we switched to robots. And then uh, two years ago, we had a, a barn fire that kind of took everything out and uh, kind of had a big decision to make and uh, decided to actually change uh, robots uh, to, to De Laval. And uh, a few sleepless nights, but uh, <laughs> it ended up being real good. And it's worked out really, really well for us. And I think we're, we're yeah, pretty we're happy. happy. Oh yeah. yeah. That's ah. the biggest improvement in my opinion. Because before we had, it was like a three guy operation just to get one heifer in there. We like essentially had to stop what we were doing just to train one cow. But now I could easily do it myself, like no problem. It's like no cow in this barn's a worry to train anymore. The nice thing too is the box actually conforms to the cow. Mm. And a lot of people say, oh, well, if it gets too tight, they'll be scared. No, it doesn't get too tight. It just lets keeps her from moving forward yeah. and back and down. Stops the shift. Oh, it does. Yeah. She's not going to try to jump in the grain bin. She feels fine and secure. It's nice and open to the rest of the herd. They can all see that. Yeah. And then they calm down quite a bit too. Yeah. And they barely dance. Whereas this one, it doesn't matter. It, it can be your biggest cow, your smallest cow, your highest udder, your lowest udder. It doesn't matter. It'll hook it up and it'll probably milk her within six minutes, which is impressive. I mean, they're so calm in this thing. It's almost like they've been milking before. Yeah, it's, you know, it's not a problem. Yeah. <laughs> I would say what, four four to five late cows a day to grab yeah. in your circuit, so. Yeah, per robot, that's three cows a robot, two or three cows a robot, that's pretty good. Yeah. And we were still getting 3. Yeah, over two, three, yeah, easily. 3.3 yeah. visits a day. In and summer that, too, and right? That's Where in that's summer more heat. stress. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, you, I mean, typically in a robotic system, you're going to get a few less visits when the cows are stressed out from heat. It's just something you deal with. And uh, last year, visits didn't really drop, and we were kind of trying to get them get, get as much milk as we can in the summer. So we put a few more on it, and it was fine. I mean, our, our goal is to be 120. Uh, yeah. I know uh, the, the salesman has said 135. We'll see yeah. about that <laughs> if we ever get there, but. Uh, it seems like it could handle it. I know for a hundred cows, we're getting almost three and a half visits a day. And that's that's great. Yep. For us, we're, we're expanding, right? We're, we're trying to buy more quota. So right now we're under capacity, but we plan on probably getting another 15, 20 cows in the barn. And with this, we can. Like yeah. I, I can say that we can for yeah. sure, right? 